Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Comfort. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to snap your T call to USDT. Okay, using Metamax. And so many people have been requesting for the video, so I so guys I've made out time to record this video. So before we get into this video, do well to subscribe to my channel and like this video, give this video a thumbs up, share this video with your friends. Okay, let's get into this tutorial. Okay, so now if you don't have a um, T core test net on your MetaMax, you need to add it. Okay, you need to add T core to your MetaMax. You don't need to use the main net. I'm just gonna use a um, test net to carry out this action. So I have 11 T core here on my wallet. I have 11 T core in my wallet, and I have two. 2262 USDT on my wallet. So let's. I'm going to swap this to USDT. I'll go to my browser. I'll click on my browser. Then I'll type in the network. Okay. I'll type in the link. Then it will direct me to Uniswap and I'll connect my wallet. Click to connect my wallet. Then let's scroll down. We are going to swap T core to um, USDT. SUSDT. So we are going to select my I'm going to select my token. Remember we are swapping T core to SUSDT. So T core will be at the at the top. Y SUSDT will be at the bottom. So I'm going to select my token now. Okay, and I'll click on SUSDT. Now, see, so I'm going to put on the amount of the um, T core that I'll be swapping. I, I'll be swapping three T core. So, let's see how let's see how much is going to be. Okay, now three T core is equivalent to 2435 um, SUSDT. So, just go ahead and click on swap. Go ahead and click on swap. So, guys, I'm going to come back here again. Before we do that, if you don't have um, T core test net on your wallet, let's go back. I'm going to show you how to add it to your wallet. So, let's go back. All you got to do is to click on your menu at the left hand side of your MetaMask. Click on the menu. Then you click on, once you click on the menu, you go to settings. Okay, you go to settings. And then the next thing you need to click is add network okay let me highlight it for you okay you have your add network so go ahead and click on add network and click on add networks then i'll go ahead and click on add network okay I'll click on add network go to custom network go to custom network for those of you that doesn't have the test net because this is the test net that you will use to perform this action okay your test net don't go to your main net okay don't link any address to your main net you, you are going to use a um, test net to perform this action so the next thing now is for me to create my test net t core so we, ha we have the network name the network name is satoshi chain test net i'm going to type in satoshi satoshi chain satoshi chain test net then let's move on to the rpc the rpc you put in https https slash um colon slash then rpc you don't need to worry because i'll drop down the link on the description box test dot btc dot network just follow the steps the way I filled it here. Filled here. The network. Okay. Then after that, you move on to the chain ID. Put on. Put right. Type in one one and five. You can see that it's showing that this network has already been added. So guys, this I've already added this to my MetaMask. So for you that doesn't have net and um, test net to carry out this action, you just need to follow this step to add test net. 
chapter sheet to your meter marks, okay? So now the symbol is T core. It's T core. Then the explorer, you type in HTTP, HTTPS, okay? Then semicolon slash slash, then scan, scan the test. The test dot btcs dot network network okay having done that i'm just gonna go ahead and click on add token so i can see down that my mine is not highlighted because i've already added this but in your own case it will be highlighted all you got to do is to click on the blue button click and then it will automatically add to your meta map and that's how to add and then um, T core test now. now I'm gonna go back here and show you how to claim the uh, faucet test net. Okay, how to claim the faucet test net after adding. Remember, we have just added our T core. Let's go back to wallet. Okay, I've added my T core now. How to claim the faucet because some of you do not have this faucet on your MetaMax. So, where to claim it and how to claim it. So, let's just get into that where to claim it and how to. Um, claim it so that's the next thing we are going to talk about <coughs> so how to claim it I'm going to, I'm going to go back to my I'm going to go back to my um, browser I click on browser then I will type I will type um, the faucet the faucet link I'll type in the faucet link Just need to wipe out the screen of this. Then I'll type the faucet link. HTTP dot scan scan the test dot um test dot btc dot network. Network. Remember now we are going to claim our um, test net T core. So we we'll click on search. We just like to load. Okay, so I have to scroll down, then click on this faucet. By the time you type it, it will appear like this. So I'll, I'll scroll down, then click on faucet. And we are going to claim this T core. And I'll click on faucet. Then you copy your um faucet link, faucet address, copy your faucet address and then press it here. Press your faucet address. Then come um click that you are not a robot click on I'm not a robot. After clicking that click on get T core. Okay? Get T core. Okay, I still have some hours left to claim it, so I just have to go back to my MetaMax. Okay, so now let's go to swapping. I've showed you how to connect your um, um how to create an account with them. Um, T core test net. Okay, why are you doing this? You need a special account. You don't need to use your main net. You're going to use the Satoshi test net to do this. Okay, prior to the transaction, and I've showed you all that. I'm going to drop the details on the description box. So now we are going to swap our T core. We're going to swap T core to to SUSDT. So let's go back to browser. 
I'll click back on my browser. Then I'll type. Okay, this is just name. We are going to type the swap link. HTTP slash slash swap swap dot test. Okay. Test dot btc dot network dot network then slash we have hash then we have the put in swap swap okay I'm gonna go ahead and then click on it then we just allow it to load once again we have we have this a uni swap here so guys we are here remember that we are swapping t call to s usdt okay now we're going to select a token click on s usdt guys we are swapping t call to s usdt that means your t call should be at the top why the s usdt should be at the bottom just like i said before so i'm going to swap minimum of three um t call to s usdt now let's see the amount we are having here three coins gives me 2422 SUSDT. okay so go ahead and then click on swap so by the time they launch the main net this is how you're going to swap it okay and remember this is a test net by the time they launch the main net this is the process you're going to use they'll provide a link to swap it and you're going to use this link you're going to follow the steps to swap your t call to usdt so I'll go ahead and confirm the swap click on swap okay i'll screw down and i'll confirm it let's wait for the confirmation okay i'll screw down allow it to load the task we have been deleted deducted okay to the cast um estimated cast fee 0 0.003 and then the total t call to swap is 3 t call and i'll go ahead and click on confirm okay transaction submitted so now I've swapped successfully swapped my T call to SUSDT. Transaction complete. So okay, let's go back to my wallet and check and swap minimum of three T call. So let's go back to my wallet. I'm gonna close here. Okay, I'm closing. Remember, not all the tokens added to this swap are only used for testing. They don't have any value. Please do not use them for real transactions. Okay, that's all to say on this platform. So let's go back to my wallet and check if it has been swapped okay i was having 2000 something before 2000 now i have 4684 usdt so guys this is how to swap your t call to s usdt like i said follow all the steps i dropped on the video if you have not if you don't have t call at all create and create a wallet by following the link i showed you create a wallet after creating a wallet go to the faucet and then claim your t call go to the faucet and then claim your t call okay you claim your t call by going to the faucet claim your usdt by going to that faucet okay and that is just how to claim it if you have any question regarding this video go do well to go to the comment section drop your question i'll do well to answer okay then on my next video we'll come back again on how to delegate your call so by the time they launch it you delegate it to get more calls okay i'll stop here today guys see you in my next video don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video, share it with your friends, give the video a thumbs up, and then turn on the bell notification, the bell button to get notified whenever I post a new video. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.